everybody! This is Quiversy! Welcome back to some uh, unexpected Terraria! I was just doing some work in between parts when uh, all of a sudden... I got invaded by aliens! This is something that can happen after you kill Golem! Uh, Martian Probe just kind of spawns. I thought that you had to be up in space for them to spawn, but apparently not, because I was building this wooden bridge here for a construction project. And wouldn't you know it, there was a Martian probe, and, well, here we are, fighting Martians. I wasn't ready to do another recording session, but I didn't want to leave this to waste. So, screw it, I'm going to do this, and then I'm going to continue my work on recording. Literally all that happened in between parts so far was me gathering up some materials uh, for purpose of this. So Martian Madness! It's tough. This is definitely harder than uh, than the solar eclipse or the, the pirate invasion. It, it's closer it, it, to the pirate invasion in terms of how it works. Uh oh. Martian drone. But the main thing I remember about this is you can get some really cool stuff. So hopefully I'm going to get lucky and get a couple of good drops out of this. Also, I'm apparently getting hit with a debuff that says that he can't move, but I'm clearly still moving. Yeah, a lot of Martian officers with bubble shields, Martian walkers. There's a couple of other things that can spawn that we haven't seen yet. Right now, I'm more just worried about killing everything. Brain scramblers. Ooh. Okay, let's just... Those bubble shields on the Martian officers. I forget if they're, like, on a timer or if it's more a matter of... Uh, you have to deal a certain amount of damage to it before you can start hurting the alien inside. I don't know... But I am killing them, so there is that. Uh, where's my yo-yo bag? Here it is. Yo-yo bag. Let's break out the yo-yos. Giga Zapper. Yeah, that's what was making that weird noise. One thing I know a lot of them drop is this uh, Martian conduit plating. That, I'm pretty sure, is just a building material. I haven't seen any of the actual good drops yet. Okay, I need to get out of the water. Martian walkers. Those are probably the most dangerous things I've faced up here so far. Oh, there's one. The Scutlix. And the Scutlix gunner on top of it. The only thing that I remember that these things drop is you can get that Scutlix critter as a mount. Looks like I didn't get it this time, though. And similar to the pirate invasion, there is also a single powerful boss entity that can be summoned. And I'm lucky I haven't encountered it yet, but at the same time, I kind of would like to encounter it, just so that I can, you know, get whatever it drops, assuming I can kill it. Ow. I have no idea what just hit me. All I know is it was Martian. Now, unlike the pirate invasion, which can happen both randomly and by summoning, I'm pretty sure that the Martian invasion can only be summoned by uh, Martian Grove. So you have to go out and find them. Or just have them come to you when you're trying to do some unrelated work. <gasps> okay, I see one item that I wanted to get. That laser drill. That's a digging item. And I'm getting some Martian vanity armor. <laughs> That's... Pointless, but cool. Tesla turrets. I, I didn't even look at what they were called before. They're Tesla turrets. Oh. Okay, so the drones just fly into you and then explode. I actually didn't realize that's what was exploding. Kill the walker.
try to focus. Oh yeah, I also had a traveling merchant. I already checked him, and he didn't have anything important. To the point that I completely forgot he even spawned. Ooh, what's that? I saw... Uh, oh, that's just the summoning of the Tesla turrets. And there's how the Martians murder. Eh. I'm not even worried. I'd rather fight closer to home anyway. So let's start fighting some aliens. On the home front. You know what? Let's do this. I picked a good time to make this change. Where is it? There it is. Behold, the Martian saucer! The mothership is here, and it is angry! I need to find mana cups. Okay. Yikes! Next thing I need to find is my Earth Stick. Oh, they're shooting the Phantasmal Death Ray! Okay. Looks like this thing has two parts to it. Because I can see two health bars. Honestly, that rocket attack is the most annoying one. Keep zapping. Keep zapping. Okay, next you're gonna do the Gatling fire. Yep. Okay, I see your game. You cycle between three. Where are you? There you are. Lower his defense a bit. Yeah, now that I'm out up in the open sky, you can also see the background has a bunch of Martian saucers in it. <laughs> it's a nice little touch. Okay, so it looks like hitting him through the middle doesn't actually do anything, because the heat ray was actually flying through it. So I guess it is just two sides. Which also means I was right to do this to try and hit... Oh, wait. So there's another health bar on top of him. Oh, so he had four parts. Two below and two above. That's what was happening. Wait, am I disabling some of his weapons by doing that? Yeah, his missiles aren't working anymore. They're just shooting out random sparks. Well, that's helpful. Let's just get rid of those turrets. Or at least one of those turrets. One to go. He yeah, gets harder to hit, but he does less damage. Or less weapons, rather. Alright, a little more. Um. Okay! Now he's angry! I mean. Ow. I was doing so well. And then he got me. Wait, the progress bar went away, but there's still Martians. Is the event still going? Okay, yes it is. Let's turn on the mask! This is unfortunately a new one. Yeah, they're even more pronounced now. So, I really need to put a focus on getting rid of the top turrets for the rockets. Okay, I can't risk the mask. I 
should also really equip the Spectre Staff. I keep flying through the death ray. That's clearly his most damaging move. The rockets are just the most annoying to evade. Okay, no more rockets. Now it's just lasers. And falling Martians! because uh, I'm on my Ethereum battle platform. Okay. Hold and shower those. Just zap away. I'm going to guess that the progress bar just went away before because I got too far away from the event. And the only reason it's still active right now is because I'm, well, being chased by the... Martian saucer. <laughs> Wonder how much health the saucer core has. Clearly, it's got to be a lot if one turret has fifteen thousand. Thirty thousand. idea. Because the thing that's... It's, it's clear what he does when he gets into his angry phase. He goes back and forth, left and right, and sweeps with the death ray. The thing that's getting me killed at this point is that the black spot, while fast, doesn't turn fast. But... If... I were to be able to... Yeah. Being able to accelerate might actually save me here. Or... A better idea. Where... Is my tree mount? That thing might actually be a better... Well, no, because I then have to chase after the Martians that are on the ground. Yeah, I'll just trust the, the witch's broom to do the trick. Assuming, of course, that I get another Martian saucer to fight. Shields just have their own health bars. That's all it is. Oh my. Yeah, the reduced speed is noticeable, but so is the increased mobility. Oh, wait. That's also true. I could always just 
hide out under a roof. Okay, Martian Saucer, I've got an idea on how better to handle you. I need you to come and chase me. That's it. Yes! Okay, it doesn't block the death ray. I thought it was. Well, at least it blocks the rockets. So it's still helpful for right now. to make use of the toxic flask for this. Okay, I'll just wait for him to come back down and then it's back to the earth. Come on down. This thing has higher acceleration and mobility. So as long as it can still outpace the Martian Saucer when it's in angry mode, I should be fine. are gone. So now we're down to lasers. Here we go. Moment of truth. Okay, if I'm going diagonally, I outpace it. Fortunately, mana is an issue. So I may need to let myself get hit a couple points. This is doable. Or I could do this. <laughs> Feel the fury of yo-yo. Uh oh, ow. Okay, feel the fury of heat rate. Can I get a spritz on the shower? Yes, okay. I just had to hit him once.
We're gonna go back to the melee mode. Hopefully the extra defense will make a difference. Crap, I need to put on my beetle mask. And the yo-yo bag, and I kinda wanna have this on, but I don't think I can, so. Let's just go straight to the Eye of Cthulhu. I am definitely doing worse. Mainly because I can't just auto heal. Uh, I wish I had the nurse. Ah, the rockets. Gotta dodge the rockets. I didn't even kill anything on that one. Of course, part of that was also me not having uh, any health at the start of that. I'm gonna drink a potion. All right. I'm ready for you now, mothership. Okay, just remember, put all attention on the rocket launchers. In this phase, the rocket launchers are the only thing that scare me. Even the death ray isn't all that bad. It's just annoying. Looks like collision with the saucer itself does less damage than anything else it does. That actually might be an important, ooh, important uh, thing to remember for its death ray phase. All right, no more, no more rockets. Death ray. Okay, it's zapping. Dang it! Okay, Just keep flying. About to do another death ray. Ow. I'm just spamming that heal button right now. Okay, now for the important part. Ah. It started on the left. It was supposed to go to my right. Lousy, stinking... It's fine. It's fine. You know why it's fine? Because it's fine. And it's fine because I'm gonna do this. These Martians want a battle, I'm giving them a freaking war! Where'd it go? There it is! Hi, Martian Mothership. How you doing? I'm now Potion. And you're now doomed. here, you. Wow, I really got hit by one of the laser sparks from the destroyed uh, rocket thing. Okay, now we're in the danger zone. Just 
keep the yo-yos yo-yoing. And I can do it. Down to under a third. Just keep this dance up and I think I'm gonna win. Mothership! Yes! That thing is nastier than I remember. Also, I got the Cosmic Car Key, which I am extremely happy to have, and I will grab as soon as the Martians are done invading. to be fair, it would probably be helpful to me right now. So I'm gonna grab it, because the Cosmic Car Key is another mount. Hmm. Actually, hang on, let me, let me do a speed test. 41. So, no, actually, the Witch's Broom is better. Goes the exact same speed, so it's still slower than the Black Spot, but the Witch's Broom has much better mobility. I guess that makes sense. The Cosmic Car Key is available on all difficulties. Whereas the other two mounts I've got are Master Mode only. So... Basically, this is the earliest I think you could acquire a, um, Endless Flying Mount on normal difficulty. Good lord, I can't even imagine trying to fight this thing without it at this phase. play my cards right, I'm going to have another dead Martian saucer on my hands. Okay. I'm just going to keep doing this. Yeah, the extra acceleration on this thing makes this a much better mount for this type of fight than the black spot. But honestly, the black spot is still my preferred mount. Just because it's a ship. I, I think it's cool. Just die already! Thank you for listening and giving me a gun of some sort. Hi there, other Martian saucer. How are you doing today? ready for you that time. All right, now we're doing the dance, which means you're gonna die. Oh, that's my beetle endurance, right?
Got another weapon I hadn't had before. And a cosmic skateboard? What? Okay, that looks like it's gonna be a Master Mode exclusive item. And I can only imagine what a cosmic skateboard is. I swear, if that's another even better mount, I don't know what I'm gonna do. Alright, we're doing this again! Okay, at, at first I was the glutton for punishment, now it's the Martian saucers that are. Maybe I spoke too soon. That is why I love the Ninja Gear, because of crap like that. I would have died if the Death Ray dealt its full damage to me there, I'm pretty sure. I got hurt way too much there. There was no getting out of that one. That's all right. That's all right. I've already killed three of the darn things. Right now, I just want the invasion to end. I'm Marsed out. <laughs>